others around here, not you. I believe we made an agreement to seek to cure Uma my way. I said we would help you, that's it. I don't know what you want to do with them, you haven't deigned to inform us, but it's not safe, is it? Just as I thought. Which is why I think we should first try another, less invasive method. What's this method? Derives from folk traditions. I've used it many times. In 1211, to lift the curse that held the Swan of Povis, for instance. I'll take Uma into the mountains. What then? Will you howl at the moon together? A bit of respect. You're not talking to Geralt. No, we will not howl at the moon. I'll lay him down on a gravestone. Come midnight, I'll give him tea made of hemlock harvested from... But I don't see that I need to explain this to you. In my opinion. I know your opinion, but I'm not asking anyone's permission. I'm saying what will happen. I'll be back at dawn, with Uma, or whoever hides inside him. Yo creo que algo está ocultando la Jennifer. ¿eh? So, got the evening off. What do we do with it? Vesemir mentioned some roof beams in the tower need replacing. Maybe we could see to that. Or we could have a drink. Sounds a lot better than the beams. Wouldn't mind a shot myself, or two. Nothing I can do. Been outvoted. Let's go. Uh, Yen, we don't have glasses. You alright drinking from a mug? I'd drink from an old boot tonight. <sighs> Perhaps instead of getting crocked in deep glum, we could do some catching up. What have you been up to, Lambert? On your way west last time I saw you. Uh, yeah. Contract and land exit. Not to boast, but pretty lucrative. Yeah. Kavir's with the golds to be made. Know how much they pay there for a drowner? Shush! I'm talking now. So this giant was giving him trouble. Attacking convoys, dragging folk off into the swamps. And relieving himself on the highway, rendering it dreadfully slippery. You've built enough suspense. Get to the point. Fine. Turned out, it wasn't a giant. Just a fat forest troll. And a group of bandits were ambushing the convoys. What did you do? Killed the bandits to keep the road safe. Then I killed the troll. Needed its uh, head to collect the bounty. Pragmatic as ever. You could stand to show some of Lambert's expediency. Set ideals like justice for trolls aside, keep yourself out of poverty instead. Knew the sorceress would see it my way. Where do you go while you are away, asshole? Aldersburg. Hunted a higher vampire. Oh ho ho. Dangerous horse sons, those. Finicky, too. Specimen in question only went for young women from the upper classes. That's like me. We've no interest in your fantasies, Lambert. Whereas the vampire, even I'm curious to know how you managed. My clan threw a masquerade ball for the city's notables to lure the vampire out of hiding. I was there, too, disguised. Let me tell you, never had so much success with the ladies as I did that night. <laughs> what about the vampire? I'd made a deal with this young alchemist. She really loaded up. Fish tech, vodka, magic mushrooms. Went out into the garden. Vampire found her and drank his fill. Fight was an afterthought. Hmm. A fairy tale on gluttony from modern times. Alchemist come out of it all right? Fine. Lost a bit of blood, I suppose. Hangover was the worst part. She drank nothing but pickle juice for the next month. 
Eventful times for me recently. Kings, dragons, conspiracies. And then, I found Yen. Yeah, we're thrilled for you. But why don't you tell us about Uma instead? Long story. I was on Ciri's trail. Went to Velen, Skellige, Novigrad, where Dandelion needed saving again. He could caught plowing somebody he shouldn't have been. Right. Speaking of old friends, Novigrad and plowing, how's Triss? Triss is managing all right. How are those scars she got at Sodom? Still there? Lambert, not funny. Fine. Conversation turned serious. Let's talk. Yen, what do you plan to do with Uma? I said I'd tell you tomorrow. So tell us now. It's after midnight. I'll subject him to the trial of grasses, but only... You'll fucking what?! Mind your manners, Lambert. Did you hear what- Not gonna ask you again. Uh, sorry. Looking to turn him into a witcher? Of course not. As I was about to say, I'll only apply the first half of the trial, because- Because you wanna watch him suffer? Stop interrupting, or I will watch you suffer. To restore Uma's former appearance, we must first- Hmm. How do I explain it? Imagine a lump of clay. In order to shape it, you must first moisten it or it will crumble. The trial's initial part does just that. It opens the body to change, so to speak. Only then can the mutagens produce a witcher. What are the chances Uma will survive? Not great. But we've no choice. Unless Vesemir can do the trick with his hemlock. Might be surprised. Old man knows his stuff. It'll be the first trial in years. Decades. I knew you'd be wary. Wary? That's not the problem. Those secrets have been forgotten. And that's how they should stay. I'd be the last to suggest you start producing hordes of witches. You hardly need to. See? Till now, we had a great excuse not to take in apprentices. Seems we'll need to talk it over. Maybe later. Who's up for another round? Oh, I am. But we're all out of step to chew on. Geralt, mind raiding the kitchen? Not at all. Gentlemen, pleasure drinking with you. Lambert, especially. But the hour is late. Como lo mueve al Gerald. Tomorrow is an important day. Presiento que va a haber problemas con los brujos. <laughs> Didn't listen, did he? They never do. What are you talking about? Sam Avila contract Esco got a while back. Good story. Finish it in a minute. First, some more fuel. Ooh. Now that's a kick in the liver. What is it? The gauntlet. Equal parts spirit and white gold. What's that look about? Yen's gone to bed. Time for some serious drinking. Damn straight. Pour us another. Bottoms up. <laughs> Las mujeres siempre con sus cosas de. No tomes mucho. No te duermas tarde. Ni modo, quería dormir calientito el vato, ¿no? Come on, let's have some fun. Are we boring you? No, no it's just kind of slow. Pretty boy's right. Listen, there's this game. Student from Oxenford taught. Hmm? Someone, Someone starts, starts by saying, I've never, and finishing the sentence however they want. Who's ever done that thing, downs a shot. Then it's the next guy. Sounds great. You start. I've never slept with a succubus. How 
about that? Esco, Esco. Still waters run deep. I'm a sucker for women with horns. Right, my turn. I've never, after a vendor, woken up wearing nothing but my knickers. <laughs> Geralt? Lambert's a lost cause, but you? What would Papa Vesemir say? I think Papa Vesemir would have drank that down too. All right, Geralt, your turn. I've never... Taken Fistic. Esco. Really? Once, with that succubus. Right, man. Let's end on that. Or else I'll never be able to look you in the eyes again. <laughs> Colder and up a nice giant's ass in here. Gentlemen, I shall return. Gotta go join the dragon. Gotta say, I'm pretty warm. He's always been a wuss about the cold. Remember winter 15 years ago? When the snow stayed around until Bellatane? Mm-hmm. Lambert sat by the fire, wrapped in a blanket. Cussed copiously every time it started to snow. Hello, youngins. Got your own little carnival going, eh? Alcohol, my good man, is a witcher's worst enemy. Where did you dig up that body? Vesemir's trunk. The height of fashion in 1112. Old man probably put it on when he went courting, or in the jargon of the time, wooing the damsels. Men, a witcher's life is not all cards and liquor. It is toil. It is labor. No gurgling babes to wean for us. Nay, not for us. All right. One Vesemir is enough. Take that off before you get it dirty. And pour. Oh, I'll pour, Eskel. I'll pour. To the brim. Cause without vodka, you're as stiff as a bookkeeper in a body gap. So, watch this about a Sama Villa? Snared this peasant in the dance. Instead of being happy, he escaped with his life. Yokel fell head over heels in love, wanted me to trap him. Turned him down, so he tried it on his own with a fishing net. Bet you they're still dancing. Great story, with a moral too. Really? What's that? Stay away from dangerous women. All right, change the subject. Cause you refuse to admit I'm right? Whatever, fine. Stop being a smart ass, poor. Vámonos a dormir ya, porque. Vodka. The vodka's gone. Who's gonna go get some more? Already went to get food. All right. I'll do it. Kitchen. It's that way, right? Oh, Amber. Bud. Gotta tell you something. Yeah? Sometimes you're a real jackass, but I love you, brother. And sometimes you're a real blower. But damn it, I go to hell and back for you. Come here, you oaf. Damn. Broke. Good thing it was empty. Where's Esco? Back by now. We gotta look around. This is a job for Vesemir. 
Where's that witness captain wandered off to? He could be beleaguered, I wager. Come then to the rescue. Spilled some wine and crawled through it. Had to kneel down to see that. If I'd have bent over, it puked. De seguro ya está dormido. Conozco a varios así que. Ahorita vengo. Voy... Voy por unas chelas y ya no regresan. One scar, more or less, in his case. Makes no sense. Ah, uh -huh. this goes close. Hang in there, brother. We're coming. Let's go. Chop, chop. Hey, look. There he is. With his ever faithful little bleeder. Hello, Esco. Wake up. Uh, what? What happened? Got sloshed, stewed, and 57 other varieties of drunk. That's what happened. Get up. Time to have a drink. Let me alone. I'm gonna puke. Three of us get together, always ends like this. Let's find a four. Better. A woman. Not in here, but yen. Oh, we don't want to wake her. Believe me. What about that sorceress you talked to? Think about it. You turn on the megascope, cordially invite her, she teleports here. Maybe bring some friends. How's that sound? Lambert, believe you've had your last drink. You're just jealous you didn't think of it first, but is that any reason to spoil it for us? I don't have the strength to argue. Of course you don't, cream puff. Bet I could take you with one finger. Hey, relax, Lambert. Wanna fight? Huh? Wanna? Come on. Good night. <laughs> no, ahorita iba por las morras y esto se iba a largar. De por si ya duró un buen la borrachera. Pasaron por todas las etapas de un borracho. Acá lo divertido. Después acá como que yo te quiero, yo también, amigo. Y ya después, por último, yeah. okay. a la agresión. <ríe> Todos ya se despertaron menos. Y no sé, no lo pudo ayudar. Sí, everyone's up and at him. Hmm. And reeking of booze. That hat was a memento, Lambert. Relax, old man. It'll come out in the wash. <laughs> you can give the boys a rap on the knuckles later. Let's get to work. Business. Learn anything? While you were out hunting fork tails and playing with a megascope, I examined Uma. Notice one thing. At moments of, what's the term? Relaxed consciousness, he behaves differently. While falling asleep, he'd pause awake for an instant. Something different about his movements, his gaze then, but only for a moment. 
So I induced a trance, hypnotized it, essentially. No effect at first, but as he dropped into deep lethargy, I heard something. A sigh, a moan. And it wasn't Uma's voice. All right. I just don't get how that helps us. Then keep silent. Thank you, Vesemir. And I apologize for what I said earlier. Have the boys told you what we plan to do? Yes. Don't like it one bit. But I suppose I have to trust you. Right. So what now? We can begin. We need only brew the potions. Wait. Why couldn't we... Do it earlier? Because the preparatory potions for the trial are strongly reactive. They must be administered immediately after they're brewed. Satisfied? Geralt, make the potions. Here are the formulae. Eskel, take a bottle of spirit. Uh, no. After last night, I... And disinfect the tools. Well, chop chop! You don't know who's trapped in Uma's body. How did you figure the proportions? Performed a series of complex calculations, extrapolated some data, ran simulations. Meaning you guessed. Mm. Yes? What is it, Wolf? See you later, Vesemir. ¿Y dónde los tengo que destilar? Se destila los extractos de hierbas. Ajá, ajá. ¿Lo tendré que crear? Ay. Yes, what is it? See you later, Vesemir. Vas Jennifer. Tools too. Good. Vesemir? Hookweed extract to deaden the pain. I know done this before. Eskel, make the incisions in his veins. Insert the tubes. Geralt, place the potion vials in the feeders. Vamos, Uma, resiste. Open the valves. It doesn't matter in which order. The hook we'd work? If it hadn't, the pain would have sent him into shock, killed him. So, everything's going smoothly? No, but it's within no norms. Administer the next potion. Se va a morir yo creo. I had hoped. I had hoped I would never have to watch this again. Why did you keep the table then?
Geralt, next, next potion. potion. Amiguito. Now we wait for the potions to do their work. Might take a day. Might take more. You need only wait. True. But I must maintain a stabilizing spell. Uma's body is not nearly as resilient as a young candidate witches. Without this, he... Yeah! Eskel, I'm sorry. Would you mind? Getting some rags? On <laughs> Ya la vomito toda. I can't believe we're doing this. Wiping vomit off the floor? No. A trial. If that's Siri in there, she could come out of this crippled, wrong in the head, just emotionless. Thought about that? Should have started by. Gentlemen, the floor's as clean as it'll ever be. And I need to be wiped down as well. Carol, maybe you wanna. Come now, Escort. I shan't bite you. Just do it. Yes. Uma's body is disintegrating from the inside. Once that's complete, we'll need to reform it. Or he'll die. You witches were given mutagens. We will use spells. Then do something to keep me awake. I don't know. Tell me a story. Heard about the time Siri and I went ice skating? No, not that I recall. The winter she trained here. A couple months in, she started complaining I was too harsh a teacher. Brushed it off at first, then she asked me to go skating with her. Didn't really want to. I'd never been before. But she insisted. As soon as we hit the ice, she started skating circles around me, hollering, No, not like that. Footwork. One, then the other. Crossover. No, wrong. Break with the heel of your skate, not the toes. Needless to say, from then on... He's awake. It's time. Time to lift the curse. Prepare the phylactery. ¿Quién será? Sobrevivirá.
No, no es Siri. Listen, Sage, we didn't lick that curse to play riddles with you. In Skellige, follow it into the mists. Hurry! Hurry! I tried to protect her. But the curse, the hunt, has not found the iron as yet. It is a matter of time. Enough, Gout. He's not yet free of death's grip. I'm going to get Syria. Hold on. Don't you think you owe us some answers? How do you know this, Avalon? What's Siri been doing with him? Yennefer can tell you. Just keep an eye on him. He's not a friend. Perhaps not, but Siri apparently trusted him. We should at least take his words seriously. You heard what he said. Take Siri from that Isle of Mists, and the hunt will pick up her trail immediately. What then? What's your suggestion? Siri can't flee forever. One day she'll stumble, and she won't get a second chance. Time we the hunted became the hunters. Geralt will find Siri and bring her here. And the hunt will follow. They'll expect to catch us by surprise, and they'll be sorely disappointed. We plan to fight them. We five? In a crumbling castle? Do we have a choice? Besides delaying the inevitable? Pretty boy could try to round up a few others who know how to swing a sword. Or wield magic. Fine. I'll get Siri and recruit some allies. Bring everyone here. Got a few favors I can call in. Any good looking women in that batch? Mm-hmm. Exclusively. <laughs> And you? What do you plan to do? I've Avalon to care for. He's certain to die without gentle gradual magic treatment. There's hope if I help him. Not much, but better than not. The boys and I'll consider how we should greet our uninvited guests. All right. Time I was on my way. Good luck, Wolf. And give Cirilla our love. Come back quickly, Geralt. Por eso tenía que ayudar al... Al rey ese con sus, con sus hijos porque... Ahora necesitamos de su ayuda.
Allez. En Belén no tenemos camaradas porque matamos a la a la maga y el conde se murió. Bueno, el este, el varón, el varón sanguinario. Nivel 22. Tuturu. Por eso dijo que misión fallida en Belén porque no tenemos aliados ahí. Es lo que tiene este de juego que casi casi es como un juego de azar, ¿eh? Como el de un tildown. No sabes si tus elecciones o acciones que tuviste antes van a repercutir con el futuro. Pues ni modo, ya no queda más que otra. Más que jugar con lo que tenemos. Jennifer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf. And an elven sage at that. Avalok, for this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt, then hidden her away on the Isle of Mists. Que imagínense qué hubiera pasado si yo hubiera detenido el tratamiento que le estaban dando. Imagínense qué rollo nos hubiéramos enfrentado. ¿Quién sabe dónde habrán quedado mis armas?
Pues ni modo lo que tengo ahorita. No vengo para quedarme, señora. A ella tampoco la ayudé. A ver si me tira paro. Voy a tener que ayudarla. ¿Qué quieres hablar sobre? Tengo un mensaje extraño. No sé qué pensar. ¿De quién fue? Ingrid Vagelbutt, sirvente. Aparentemente, la señora Vagelbutt se prepara para donar una tidy suma. Quiere ayudar a los mages a escapar de Novigrad. Creo que esto no sería un mensaje de charla. Tengo que hablar con ella. 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 Says he needs to explain everything face to face, but these days I can't be sure meeting him's a good idea. Don't like this at all, but you seem determined. Not about to let you deal with it alone. Thank you. The servant. How are you supposed to contact him? Said I'd recognize him. He'll be in a blue tunic, have a load of keys strapped to his belt. I'm supposed to ask him about the price for his trout. Whose idea do you think this was? The servants or Vagel Buds? My bet's on Ingrid. Highborn damsels have a lot more time than their servants to read adventure novels. Think it'll be better if I talk to the mystery man in the blue tunic. He's expecting to meet me. You just wait nearby. I'll make sure that note didn't come from the witch hunters. Then you come in. Mm-hmm. Fine. Let's meet there. Yes, Geralt? So long, Tracy. Vamos a ayudarla porque si no después no nos van a querer ayudar amigos, eh. Lo presiento. Porque este juego se trata de eso, de dar y tomar. Tiene un arma mejor porque. Top notch swords. 
Espadas de primera. Show me what you have in stock. Muestra que, muéstrame que tienes, compadre. Compadre. Vamos a vender, a vender, a vender. Vendida. Vendida, vendida. Vender, vender. Es necesario nivel 20, ya casi vamos a llegar, así que yo creo que sí la vamos a comprar esta, ¿eh? 35, armadura, nivel 19. Más 20 resistencia, 20, 20, 30. 25. Yo creo que voy a comprar esta. Más 12. Más 12, más 14. Más 12, más 12. Más 12. Hay que empezar a armarnos, amigos, ¿eh? Porque se va a poner intenso la pelea contra... Vamos a ver si puede hacer alguna artesanía. No, somos. Salomo. Ahorita regreso. Ni quien te está haciendo nada. Lots of blue jerkins. Interesting. Ah, es este vato, mira, de pura calabaza me paré aquí. Órale, vámonos, vámonos, vámonos. First time I've laid eyes on them. Maybe. Well, recently someone's been trying to question our messengers about the young count. Hold on. Where's Miss Merigold? You would come alone, Miss. If not for him, that trio would have dragged him in for questioning. 
The tall one was Valdo Morris. Works for the witch hunters. Aye, you're surely right, miss. I... It just worked what I expected since Lady Bagel, bud. So what's this about? Be straight. Lady Vagelbud's son, he's the problem. Master Albert's taken an interest in alchemy. Temple Guard's got the wind. Wouldn't worry about the Guard, but since the Mage Hunters tried to grab you, I'd say Albert's in serious trouble. Aye. Lady Vagelbud bought off the Guardsmen, but since the Hunters pay for every Mage revealed to them... Guardsmen took a bribe from the frightened family, then whispered a word to the Hunters anyway. How did Ingrid Vagelbud know to contact Triss, that Triss was the right person? We learned Miss Merigold would help Myra Base disappear once the witch hunters were onto her. Myra provided Lady Ingrid with magical assistance on a few occasions with Milady's um, afflictions. Makes sense. Myra mentioned treating a highborn lady to me once. Seems Albert needs to disappear as soon as possible. I can arrange that. Think young Vagelbug can slip out of the house unnoticed? Taint that simple, sadly. Master Albert's in hiding at the Vagelbud's country estate. Lady Ingrid's got the notion she can get him out quietly. Wants to throw a lavish masquerade ball. Am I supposed to attend? Help him escape? I will not manage without you. Lady Vagelbud fears the help's being watched. It's a good idea. A boisterous bash. That'll distract the hunters. Especially if even half of what I've heard about the Vagelbud's balls is true. Word is, at the last one, they served a hundred different desserts, and the fireworks boomed from dusk till dawn. What with the war and all, Milady's ordained but 85 desserts this time. Won't be no candy petals or blue roses from the Zair. The roses have become dreadfully hard to come by. Oh, I'd love to see it all. Hope we won't have to stay till the end. You're coming with me? Of course I am. Not about to send you into what could prove to be the lion's den by yourself. Think about it. 85 desserts. While you're still trying to keep your waist at 22 inches. Carol, please. How do we get to the residence? Your invitation. Take it. Guard at the gate will have instructions for you. You're to wear a fox mask, alright? Good luck to you. Think we can head there now? You're kidding, right? We have to prepare. Change clothes. Most importantly, buy our masks. I bet you can get everything we need for the ball at Eliel's shop. You know it? Been there before. Eliel's a friend of Dandelion's. Just masks, right? Probably don't need to wear a doublet, do I? A doublet, Geralt. And it's not up for discussion. Take care of that and come and see me. That's where you belong. Most 